brand new day at Dabby begins. Wonder what today has in store for us. Oh, a message from Deadpool and. I never ran into a steak too chewy for my choppers. Eddie is outside our door. Howdy, partner. What's cracking? You seem quite Hello. today. Why shouldn't I be? Got a full eight last night, just started a new supplement, and I've got a renewed outlook on my future. Okay. That's good to hear. I am glad to see you in high spirits. Thanks. Although, I'm probably mostly just in a good mood because I started researching a new story. A story? What kind of story? I had this revelation. I mean, you know I'm a trained journalist. I get a thrill when I break open a big corporate conspiracy or report on a public good. Sure. You want to do more reporting? Yeah. We've been so busy fighting Lillin and vampires with a Y that I haven't had time. I'm feeling this itch in the back of my head telling me to get out there and dig up some dirt. Hmm. Well, if that's what you feel you should do, then... You have my blessing. Ah, good. Because I've already started. Oh. I want to look into Dracula's history with the new breed vampires. What was his grand plan? How did he get into a feud with Mephisto? And is it true that a secret cabal of vampires controls the internet? That all mm. sounds interesting. Yeah. Probably shouldn't say anything more at this point. You never know who could be listening. In the Abbey? No one can spy on us here. Exactly. Wink, wink. Let's keep this between us, okay? Oh. Alright. As you wish. And I thought Spider-Man was strong. Right back at you. No? I still can't believe Tony Stark is here. In the Abbey with us. Crazy, isn't uh it? That is one way to You just realized that? I mean, the guy's the richest, smartest dude on the entire planet. L least according to his website. I don't know. Uh -huh. You think maybe he'd be able to do me a favor? You know, after we save the world, I mean. Well, depends on the favor, I guess. As with anyone, Robbie, I would think it would depend on what exactly you are asking for. Yeah, I know, but he's Tony Stark. People probably ask him for stuff all the time. I don't want to be that guy. Those people do not fight by his side. It's not even for me. It's for my brother Gabe. He's paralyzed from the waist down. The only wheelchair I can afford right now is not exactly the deluxe model. I was hoping Tony could maybe help build Gabe some upgrades when this is over. Repulsor beams optional. Stark is loud and foolish, but he has a good heart. Talk to him. If he can help your brother, I'm sure he will. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, thanks, Hunter. No? You got it, Robbie. Hey, Tony. Your armor is quite incredible. Oh, thanks. I also make an amazing grilled cheese. Mm. Hunter, I'd love... Buddy, talk to me. Love to try it one day. Uh, ooh, advanced photography. Uh, shooting, clean chapter, taking better action shots, and how to sell photographs to potential. Oh, this might be a gift for Spider-Man or Eddie. Any any of the reporters in the room? Um, oh, Nico wants a word. She wants help with something. Hey, can I ask a favor? I I literally just did that. Wow, what are the odds of that? I literally just complimented him. Um. See you soon. <sighs> can I load a prior save? Of course. All right, bear with me for a moment. This is. 
this, this is unorthodox, I know, but just bear with me. We haven't made we haven't made too too like large of progress from the moment we slept, so we're just gonna slightly rewind rewind time back to over here when we slept. I don't know who thought of having it do an autosave before you sleep, not when you wake up um, or maybe both but anyway that's just a minor that's just a minor mi minor gripe no big deal uh, okay so what do we say we said good for you and then we said support and then we said oh and then uh, we're gonna compliment and I thought Spider there we go strong. and oh now magic wants hey, to oh can I ask a favor? Hunter <sighs> What? The hunter stalks its prey. Oh, the Man, I just wish I could have brought my brother Gabe along. He loved this place. The talking points are different now. Who is a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. <sighs> well, that's a shame. Okay, so this time it's Magic who wants me to compliment Carol. Uh, also, the gifts are also changed. We got World's Grossest Candy. And Marjorie Poor in Pictures. I think we already have Grossest Candy. Uh, could be wrong. Let's just quickly check. Oh no no no! I think I think we gave grossest candy to Deadpool. I think. So let's just buy another hmm. another copy of that. Um, okay. So yeah. What was I saying? Right. Yeah. This time we have to compliment Carol, and unfortunately Carol is already maxed out friendship with us, but. I not think you are even close to your limits. You think That's a shame. You know what? I, I almost want to reload the safe again and see if things change. But you know what? Never mind. We're already deep enough in this hole as it is. Let's okay. just... Thanks, Hunter. Let's just get her done and move on. Uh, right, okay. My That's it now. Nobody wants to talk. All right, let's go hang out with Deadpool. He's bored again, so he wants us to chit chat like old grannies. Could be fun. You wanted to talk? When you put it that way, it makes it sound like I'm in trouble, and not the fun kind. Did you do uh -huh. something? Anyway, I'm glad you're here. Open uh up those ear holes. Deadpool's gonna tell a story. <sighs> Go on. Once upon a time, there was a handsome Merc who had friends and family that loved him. But chaos and destruction followed him wherever he went, and it ended up hurting the people he cared about most. He waved goodbye and peaced out to live a life of solitude. The end. I'm still workshopping it, but I think it could be made into a movie. Sounds like you've had it rough. <sighs> you know, you make this setup so easy, it's not fun sometimes. I'm being serious. You have had hard experiences. Thank you for opening up to me. See? It's almost unfair how the jokes write themselves. But, ah, I figured you deserve to know where I'm coming from. <laughs> <clears throat> Do you feel better now that you have told me? Eh, give me three to five business days and I'll get back to you. You put too much pressure on yourself. Duh, don't you? It is unavoidable at times, but I try my best not to. Someone tell them they're in a video game and the pressure is all an illusion. Ahem. 
What? A little pressure isn't so bad. Tell who? What? It keeps us in check. And it feels great along my happy trail. Now you know my sob story. No more mushy gushy talk, all right? All right. As you wish. Deadpool. Getting word of another attack. Vampires in Central Park. Right before dawn. Can you imagine? Dawn? I knew this was coming. Just not so soon. The city is in enough chaos. We'll handle it. No problem. Ah, uh, Blade. Ever the optimist, hmm? Time to show him what for. Just to keep you away from getting to feel safe in Central Park again. Yes, I'm afraid they'll have to cancel their picnics and ball games for today. I'm sure they're more worried about surviving. As they should be. Never seen that before. Did I just seriously waste that? <sighs> Incredible. Alright. Can't make this stuff up, folks. Overrun like this. All that work. Piss me off. Am I that transparent? In honesty, I heard you fight hard. I'm fond of that tactic myself, Doctor. As you can see, he doesn't always buy it. Or maybe I only play along when I feel like it. Trick. 
I'll make quick work of you. you try here we go again without sunlight to fall back on my job is about to get a lot harder you seem to have plenty of other tools or toys at your disposal nothing scares a vampire more than this it's your fair point here it comes Whatever gets the job done. <laughs> this won't take me. That's one hell of a move. Watch me. That'd be a lesson to you. There we go. Do not fear the sun. I'll give them something to fear. No. Allow me! Okay. So, Defeating Dracula. Here we over. go. How long has it been since you felt the sun? Centuries. The better part of a millennium. But you already knew that, Blade. And thanks to your unlikely ally, Dr. Morbius, I will bask in the dawn for eternity. And I thought man thing was ugly. Set of adamantium fangs. Eternal. 
is at hand. So be it. Oh dear. It's a lot of damage. I'm gonna make you pay for that. You won't leave here alive. My children will finally know true freedom. The power to rule the day just as easily as we rule the night. <laughs> Maybe it's some rat hole of Transylvania, but New York is my town. That is all about to change, just as it began with the rising sun. Excuse me? Dear. This isn't good. I think I've come full circle. My salvation and my curse all began with you. A common refrain from vampires who have <laughs> Not everyone wants to feed on the innocent. You never did understand that. I understood perfectly well. I just don't indulge in weakness.
Give me no choice. You should not have come here. It is hard to resist the bloodline. Okay. Just use his ultra on him. That's fun. I'll remember your face. Excellent progress. Tried harder. Where are you going? You'll get yours. There we go, finally. I've been waiting. Get the shit out of here, Vlad. Must be so proud. Lost children. You disappoint us. Betray us. Shed the blood of your own. No one hurts you more than family. Join us in the light. We won't ask again. Hmm. You won't. But not for the reason you think. I don't understand. Why aren't you? To mass produce the serum, you diluted my sample. Yes, it protected you from the sunlight, but each use of your powers burned more of it away. You are, as they say, running on fumes. And when those expire, so do you. This isn't over. It is, for now. Unless you'd care to stay for a walk in the park. Back to the sewer, where he belongs. Are you disappointed we didn't destroy him? Nah, he always comes back. But knowing he's got to live with that humiliation almost makes it worth knowing you. Sounds like everyone had a successful mission today. Oh? For once, my failure of science has worked to our advantage. You might not believe it, Hunter, but this ordeal with the sunlight serum is finally over. Dracula has nothing. That is well, fantastic. that's good to hear. I knew you and Blade could take care of business. The sunlight serum is so diluted it no longer poses a threat. The vampires have been cast back into the night, where they belong. Mm. I don't think I can properly express my relief. Hunter, if you had not been there to lean on throughout all this, I do not know how I would have survived. This plague of vampires put stress on the whole team. We supported each other. You are too kind. I'm glad I found such a welcoming family of heroes. And about that. Yes? Hunter, you should know that I will remain committed to the Midnight Sun's greater mission. You all helped me in my time of need. 
It is only fair that I return the favor. The oh. Support is much appreciated. Well, yeah. Marvelous. But before we move on, we must make one final decision regarding the Sunlight Serum. We? Oh, yes. I value your guidance. My prototype sample is no more, but I still possess my research notes. I could continue my experiments in the hopes of curing myself and maybe others, unless the risk of it falling into the wrong hands seems too great. You know what? I'd say that curing this um, sort of pseudo-vampirism is definitely worth, worth the risk, if you ask me. If a cure is possible, you should continue to look for it. If someone tries to exploit your research again, we will be here to stop them. I was hoping you would feel that way. I can't wait to get back to work. After this business with Lilith is settled, of course. Of Thank course. You for your help, Hunter. Uh, of course. You are Morbius. The first person who failed to notice me. All right then. Exciting stuff. I wish all vampire threats were this easy to dismantle. I can't believe I'm saying this aloud, but I think I figured out Dracula's master plan. Go on. What is it? There is a Lilith connection, but it's not direct. Dracula uh. is acting like he knows the world is coming to an end. Didn't expect him to be an apocalypse prepper, but here we are. Think of every play he's backed so far. Some of his plans overlap, right? I had noticed that. I suppose. That's because he's throwing everything at the wall to see what sticks. It doesn't matter what plans fail. As long as one succeeds, he wins. The good news mm. is, we're foiling his plans faster than he's setting them in motion. If we keep nipping these buds, he'll have nothing left. Let's debrief on the latest. Looks like All right. Dracula's plan went up in smoke. See what I did there? I did. Yes, I, I did. Is the sunlight serum truly gone? Dracula still has a supply, but it's barely effective, as you experienced. For a master plan, this one was a real dud. Hmm. Dr. Morbius may have a different opinion. Hey, if he deems it a bigger threat than I think it is, I'm happy to run it down. But for now? Central is tracking all mention of the Sunlight Serum or anything like it. Unless it finds something, I think we're done here. Anything else on your mind? Uh, no. I suppose not. Thanks, Carol. See ya. Yep. Blade? You were right, Blade. Morbius proved very useful today. You know, even I'm impressed that he stared down Dracula. So, did the two of you bury the hatchet? We're not exactly friends, but I appreciate his experience in the field. Sounds like someone is mm. developing a grudging respect for the living vampire. Okay, sure. Just don't tell him I said that. You know, grudging respect is the first step to real friendship. It's time to drop this, Hunter. All right, Blind. As you wish. Um. Despite his setback, do not consider Dracula defeated. He has survived centuries for a reason. It seems we can finally put this ordeal with Morbius' serum behind us. Thank yes, you. it seems so. Uh, more important things to focus on now. Hunter, thank you for not being overly harsh with Morbius. I only did what seemed to be right at the time. I would say you are wise beyond your years, but you have more years than most of us put together. Maybe that's what makes you so discerning. And still no wrinkles. Indeed. I am just glad that Morbius found some peace of mind. I am familiar with that journey. It's not easy. Be proud of your part in that, Hunter. 
Yes. I suppose I should, shouldn't I? I don't know if I could have reversed the effects of the sunlight serum with my magic. <laughs> it's best that it didn't come to that. Alright then, well... I suppose that, that's it for today. It's time to get some rest.